Hi, this is Ian from CAD Dimensions, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can take your X Design part and quickly make a 2D drawing from it using X Define. So, in order to get to X Define, all you have to do is switch to the X Define app. You can do this by hitting the switch icon or hitting X on the keyboard. Once the app is switched over, you can see in the upper left hand corner that the X Design app that I was working in will be switched over to the X Define app. You should also get a notification in the lower right hand corner saying that the transition has been completed. To create the views, all I have to do is select create views on the lower right hand side and start picking the views that I think are going to matter the most when dimensioning. I'll do the front view, the right view, the top view, and the left view. When I pick these ones, all I have to do is see if that matches on the model and then hit apply and repeat. When I have all the selections completed, I can exit out using the green or red check mark. To start dimensioning, I have to activate the view that I want to dimension. I can use faces, edges, vertexes, or planes to dimension the model. Once I have all the dimensions all set for the view, I can hit the green check up at the top. I can then move on to the right view. Again, all I have to do to activate it is double click on this. Lastly, I'll activate the top view and finish off with a few dimensions. If I go back to any of the views that I have, I can activate them and see which dimensions are associated with that view. Once I have all the views associated with the dimensions, I can go ahead and start creating a 2D drawing. I'll switch over to the drawing environment where I can select the size of the sheet that I'm working with. I can do a custom sheet, or I can stick with the standard. In this case, I'm going to use a two piece of paper. This will generate a sheet that I can use to fill out the title block information or the attributes related to the drawing. To bring in a view, all I have to do is select it and drag it into the background. Once it's all set, I can let go of the drag and it'll place the view in the drawing. I'll add the top view and the right view to the drawing. Now that everything looks in place, I can export this to a PDF. I'll choose 2D output, 2D drawing, and file on disk. I'll name the PDF 2D drawing and set the sheet size to A2 and a landscape portrait. I will then export the drawing, which will be saved to my desktop. Opening the PDF shows exactly what I wanted to export. With this drawing, I can export it to a vendor, a client, or to the shop floor. I hope this video shows how easy it is to create a 2D PDF using XDesign and XDefine. If you have any questions, please reach out to CAD Dimensions to find out more about the X apps.